morning, dear students. Today, we are going to study the properties of the magnet. As you see, iron, steel, cobalt, and nickel are the metals that can be attracted to the magnet, and these metals are called magnetic materials. As you see in the picture, and we can also uh, call about the tin, are magnetic materials. But there are some other metals or subjects that can cannot be attracted to the magnet, and these are like the wood, plastic, paper, glass, copper, brass, and rubber, and these materials are called non-magnetic materials. Let's talk about other property to the magnet, and this property is the two poles of the magnet. Magnet has two poles, north pole and south pole. And always the magnetic force of the magnet present at the two ends of the magnet, at the two poles. And as we go to the center of the magnet, this magnetic force disappear. And the magnetic force is the ability of the magnet to attract things. Uh, let's see uh, uh, the experiment to prove this. We have here a paper. And this paper filled with iron filings. Okay? And we are going to put a magnet on this iron filings. We will see that magnet attract iron filings at the two ends of it, and there is no, there are no iron filings in the center of the magnet as the magnetic force appears or present at the two ends of the magnet.